Welcome to the VoiceWare by Phone Suite Polycom phone training video. In this second video, we're going to look at some of the basic call handling features of the Polycom 650. To begin with, let's look at how you make a call. To make a call, simply pick up the handset and then dial the extension number that you're trying to reach. The other end will then begin ringing. They can pick up, you can speak. When you're done, you can either press the end call soft key or you can simply hang up the handset to end the call. Making an external call, one outside the hotel, is accomplished in much the same way. Pick up the handset and then dial the number you'd wish to call. Remembering though that usually 9 is needed in order to get an outside line. Again, when you're finished, press the end call soft key or hang up the handset. Speakerphone calls are accomplished by pressing the speakerphone key. You will then be allowed to enter an extension or a phone number. And again, when you're finished with the call, either press the end call soft key or the speakerphone button to hang up. The last way to make a call is what's known as on-hook dialing. What you can do is you can dial a number without picking up the handset or pressing the speakerphone key. Then when you're finished dialing, you can then either press the speakerphone key or pick up the handset to begin the call. This method is handy because if you make an error while dialing, you can use the backspace keys to clear that out and then enter a new number before you initiate the call. Next, we're going to look at how to place a call on hold. To begin with, we're going to make a new call. While that call is active, we can either press the hold soft key here or the hold key down here. While on hold, you'll notice that the light changed from a blinking green to a blinking red, and our icon has changed up here as well, as well as saying hold here. Once we're done and ready to resume the call, we can then press resume. Note that the soft keys at the bottom change when the call is on hold. If we place the caller on hold again, we do have the option to transfer this call or make a new call. In this case, we will simply resume the call and end it. The next thing we're going to look at is call waiting. So again, assuming we're on a call, we're speaking to extension 401 and we receive another call. We can see here that a new call has arrived. We also heard tone letting us know that we have a new call. If we'd like to speak with this call, we can place the first one on hold, then answer the new call, speak with them. When we're finished talking to this new caller, we can press end call. 401 remains on hold. Then we can press the resume key to begin talking to 401 again. The last feature that we're going to look at is how to transfer a call. So once we have a call, we're speaking with Scott and we'd like to transfer him to a different extension. So what we will do is simply press the transfer key. We now have the option to do an intended transfer or a blind transfer. An attended transfer allows us to speak to the person we're transferring to before we send the call through. A blind transfer will immediately transfer the call without allowing us to speak to the other party first. In this case, we're going to use a blind transfer. Simply press the blind key, then enter the extension where we want to transfer it to, press send, and the call will immediately be transferred without us getting a chance to talk to extension 313 first. This concludes this Polycom phone training video. You should now know how to transfer a call, place a call on hold, and make an internal and external call.